Hello and welcome back to another Space Engineers experimental video. Now I was asked to fire a gravity cannon with the speed of light mod to see what happens. So that is what I've done. I have built a gravity cannon and we are going to launch a warhead with a cockpit on it and just see what happens. Now if you're not familiar with how gravity generators work or you want to build one yourself, I will very quickly run through how you do that. This is just the inside. There's a lot of gravity generators here. It goes up to 106 Gs. So to build a gravity cannon, we're going to build a small platform, leaving a big enough gap for us to fire an object through. I'm going to be firing an artificial mass. Let's just go like that. And then like that. I'm going to put two blocks on the end here. This is basically where I'm going to be firing the object through. So it's going to go through that little gap like that. I'm then going to put gravity generators facing the direction I want to fire. So the bottom is going to be facing where the object is going to go. And it's going to be something like that. I'm then going to add some power on here to power the gravity generators. Just, oh god, my gravity cannon. Oh dear, I forgot it was a ship. So I've just very quickly remade this and my cannon is not moving this time. But yes, this is the way you generally make it. Just going to go over to here and switch off the gravity generators. Just switch them both off. In fact, make them a group, switch them off. And then I'm going to place down the object I wish to fire. So I want to fire the artificial mass. I'm just gonna plop that there. Then I'm gonna power the artificial mass. And now I'm just going to switch the gravity generators back on and goodbye object. And that is how a gravity cannon works. Now it's time to test the gravity cannon out. I'm now going to convert that to a ship. And off it goes, just like that. So now what I'm going to do is actually fire it with me in it. So I'm just going to come over to here, add a new rotor head. This is the way I've been building it. I'm going to add a, ooh, let's add the warhead there. I'm going to add a cockpit on the front because I would like to ride along with it and then some artificial mass. Probably don't need this many, but who cares? So now it's time to go for a ride on this little rocket and see how well the speed of light works with a gravity cannon. So I'm just going to press K and take remote control of my large grid. I'm now going to detach myself and away we go. Well, we're traveling at quite a high speed. And that is your answer. I'm moving at 121 meters per second. I think I'm going faster than it's actually saying, considering how fast I'm going past the asteroids. Pretty sure I saw a mayday there. But yeah, that's all which has happened. It seems like your actual maximum speed you can go is going to be based on the gravity cannon size. So the longer you make the barrel, the more speed you're going to have coming out of it and the higher the speed you are going to be shooting across the galaxy. So that is it for this little experiment and I'll be back with another Space Engineers video sometime soon. Bye bye.